In this video, I'll show you how to mirror what's happening on your iPhone to your Hisense Smart TV that has Roku on it. First thing you need to do is to go in this menu here until you see settings, tap the OK button on your remote control. Now you have to go down until you see Apple AirPlay and Home Kit. Press OK. This will open up AirPlay. It only takes a few seconds. And once you're here, you'll have many options. Make sure that AirPlay is turned on. Okay, if it's turned off, just press the OK button and it will turn it on. Then go down and depending what you want, you can decide to have a password every time you, uh, you're trying to mirror your iPhone to your Hisense Smart TV. So if you want, don't want other people doing it, you can set a password instead. Or you can say only first time, which means that all the other times you'll connect your phone to your Hisense TV, it will not ask any passwords. Okay? You can go back once you selected uh, what you want. And now you're going to take your iPhone, drag down from the top right corner to have these icons appearing. And you're going to select these rectangles here. You see there are two of them. Tap on them. Oops, here we go. And you should see your Hisense Roku TV appearing in this menu. Just make sure that your Hisense TV is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as your Wi-Fi, uh, has your iPhone, sorry. Okay, so both needs to be on the same network for this uh, to work. So you're going to select it once you see it in, these, in this list. Maybe it's the only one, like here. And it will ask a code here. The code will appear on your TV. So here it's 9803. I'll type that. 9803. And press the OK button on your iPhone. And voila. Now everything is mirrored. This way you'll be able to watch your pictures on your Hisense TV. You'll be able even to go on YouTube. And if you have a video that you want to watch on your Hisense TV, just press play once you select it and it will play it in full screen, just like that. Very handy feature. Also, what you can do is browse the internet. Okay. And obviously this is not super nice here. It doesn't take the whole screen. What you can do is just make sure that your screen lock is turned off. And this way, once you turn your iPhone sideways, the whole image will turn on your TV as well and it will take a much uh, greater space on the screen. So I hope this was useful. If so, please leave a like, subscribe and even comment. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.